All right, I've been asked a lot about where all the shrine locations are, so I'm gonna help you. First one, Water One. The Water Shrine is literally right when you exit the tutorial. So if you don't know where this is, then you are very blind. Okay, next one. You can go into the caverns for fire and earth upgraders, or you can go to the sky island and get the air and ice. Right now, we're gonna go to the fire and earth. All right, shortly after walking down the pathway right here and entering the caverns, you'll find the earth shrine. Next up is the fire shrine. All you gotta do is go right down this big corridor. Once you get this central warp right here and you reach this point, you're actually gonna go left. You'll see this man, and you're gonna go straight until you find some stairs. You're gonna go up. And you'll find a big corridor. This guy will actually stop you from going in. He will tell you you need to be level 50. How do you hit level 50? Well, you open up your attributes here and you will see your information. See, I'm level 269. If you are under level 50, hit upgrade, genetic, and just upgrade any of these. I recommend upgrading luck to at least 20 to 25 and then start working on your crit damage and critical rate. Once you hit level 50, you're gonna enter here. And here is the labyrinth. You meet Fennec, and this is the best farming spot for spirit in my opinion. All right, you see where I'm located? You'll see the warp right there. You're gonna go down this trail. And you're gonna go until you see this staircase. You're just gonna follow this pathway along so you find another big corridor. You're gonna head on in and you'll be at the King's Court. You talk to the Captain Yare or whatever your name is and she'll tell you you cannot enter and Cecilia needs help. So what you're gonna do is you're gonna go to your warp right here and you're gonna teleport to the bazaar. Once at the bazaar, you're gonna climb to the top of the tower. Once at the top, you're gonna go around here. And here is Cecilia right here. You talk to her and she will give you the quest to talk to the king. Now take the Darklands warp and you're gonna teleport back. Back at King's Court, you talk to Captain and she should let you through. After talking to the king, he's gonna give you a quest. So once you exit, you take a left. This big door should be open and there is the Fire Shrine. Okay, next is the Air and Ice Wand Upgraders. So, you're going to go to the top of the tower and you're going to go towards Celia. You're going to walk this way until you see Edmund. You're going to jump down to your little parkour and go through the portal. Fly down to the main island right here and you can see a water fountain. Here at the Health Potion and a Central Island Warp, you're going to take a right until you see some snow. And as you can see, you're right there with the big light. There's the Ice Shrine. All right, back at the central warp, as you can see in front of it, you'll see this big structure. You're gonna go towards that. You're gonna enter in here and you will find Avery. He'll give you a quest to go fight a snow golem. The snow golem is located by the frost shroud if you wanna go kill that to get the key. Once you have the key, you can open up this door after you talk to Avery and he'll take you into the library. Right there, air shrine. Upgrade your air material here. Bam, bada, boom, upgrade my air wand. Now it's level 11. Void wand, I am pretty sure you cannot upgrade. I have tried everything. It's not even in your attributes for elemental. It's not here. So I don't think you can upgrade it as of yet. As of August 21st, 2021. I don't think you can upgrade it. And that is all the locations for the shrines. If you found this helpful, be sure to hit that like button. And also subscribe if you're new. I'm trying to hit 5k by the end of this year. And I really appreciate it. Now I'm going to go help these guys because they're kind of lost. And um, have a good day.